The one coastal bend family is turning a recent tragedy into hope for young welders welding students. That's right. Our Madeline Salinas joins us live in studios with how the family of Christopher Ruiz is now honoring his legacy. Madeline, good morning. Good morning, Lexis. Back in June, 19 year old Christopher Ruiz lost his life after drowning in Lake Corpus Christi. When it came to planning his funeral, the family actually had to move his service to a larger venue to accommodate the hundreds of people that would plan to come to his service. Christopher's mother told me that he found his passion in faith and in welding. Now his family is doing what they can to help keep his memory alive. We liked to scare each other. We would just joke around. It was just constant, you know, scaring. And it was just a lot of laughing that we did here at home. Michelle Ruiz Hernandez remembers her son Christopher by looking back on his most joyful moments. Moments like these. The school came hard to him, but he loved the people. He loved making friends. He loved being around uh, people and helping them. Christopher attended Robstown ISD through his senior year. CTE director and assistant principal Benito Portillo remembers Christopher as a light for his welding classmates. He always had a smile on his face. Uh, he was always very positive and always willing to uh, help. Before graduating from high school, Christopher graduated with his level one certificate in industrial welding from Del Mar College. His mother says Christopher's love for the craft made it easy for her to decide what to do to carry on her son's legacy after he passed away. I was going through his room, going through the car, and all you saw was welding stuff. You just saw the welding gloves, you saw the welding hood, you saw the, you know, his clothes. Since his passing, Christopher's family has founded the Christopher Ruiz Memorial Scholarship for young welders looking to further their education. At this week's Robstown ISD school board meeting, Christopher's family donated 50 pairs of welding gloves. One thing about Chris is he uh, went through welding gloves pretty often, quite often. You know, it comes with the trade. The family was also able to donate a $500 scholarship for a graduating senior pursuing a welding degree. Uh, whether it be through monetary funds or equipment like, like the gloves, uh, really assists in us providing those students the career-specific equipment needed in order for them to be uh, successful in their trades. Delsh, in addition to the welding glove donation and the $500 scholarship, the Christopher, Christopher's family has also donated $500 to the volleyball team where Christopher was once a manager and to the cross country team. If you would like to make a donation to Christopher's Memorial Scholarship, you can find a link with more information on our website. John Thomas.